Hey guys and welcome to my channel. In today's video we are going to be checking out this local fish curry rice place here in Panjim city in Goa. So many of you have been asking me about fish curry rice places and this is one of my wife's and my favorite place. We ordered it on Swiggy before. We have not actually come to the restaurant before but we ordered it on Swiggy and my father orders this every couple of days. So they make really good food. So we are going to go inside and check out all the different types of fish curry rice they have and we are going to check out some seafood like prawns and stuff like that. And we are going to try it out and show you guys. So if you are new to my channel, I am a local Goan and I can give you the best advice of Goa. So if you have any questions, comment below and I will be happy to help you guys. So let's go and check out this beautiful restaurant here in Panjim city, Goa. So guys, the name of the restaurant is called Pergola, which is uh, right here in Panjim city. And over here, a uh, landmark, that's my wife, the, the landmark is this uh, Panjim police station. So if you just ask anybody where is Pergola, it's just opposite over here. So they have an air conditioned section on top and they have the regular section below over here. So let's go into the restaurant and check. Now we are here very early. So this is the lunch crowd hasn't come in yet, but they'll be here soon. So this is the restaurant is very nice and clean. So we'll go on top to the AC section. So they have a bar as well. So if you want to have drinks with your seafood, you can come over here. So let's go up to the AC section. So we're going up over here. So they have a very nice air condition section over here. It's clean and it smells good. So, you know, I prefer always eating in the open. So I'm going to sit down by the bar. So by the way, this is the place over here. So my <laughs> wife banged her leg on the door. Anyway, so we're going to go down and order our food. We'll go down and order. So the gentleman here is Mr. Nobber. He's the owner. And this is the menu over here. So guys, uh, Mr. Nobber's recommendation was the fish curry rice. Now the fish curry rice, there are two options. One is the kingfish version or you can take the pomfret version. Now there is also another one which is the mackerel fried rice. The mackerel fried rice is 150 rupees. Uh, the kingfish and the prawns, okay the prawns, we ordered prawns also. So the prawns is 280 rupees for uh, fried prawns which says 290 here but I've spoken to him he said 280 so anyway these are the prices of all the different dishes that they have here these are all Goan dishes and over here you have the seafood like pomfret over here which you can order and that is 500 rupees they have tsonak which is another fish 450 and these are the local uh, different local options over here so you can choose any one of these so guys our food is here so this is the kingfish thali and over here we have the mackerel thali so let me just show you what is in this and what's included so this is the mackerel over here and this is the rice this is the vegetable this is called tisrio which is shellfish here Okay, so we got our prawns rava fry over here. Very good, thank you very much. And this is the local Goan curry. So this is 150 rupees. And over here you have this kingfish thali, which is 180. So it has a big slice of kingfish. Let us see, it's quite thick. So as you can see, it's very thick. And over here they have prawns, rich thick curry prawns. And over here again, this rio a little pickle and a little salad over here okay so this is our seafood option over here so this is very cheap and should be very delicious guys so as you can see over here we're going to enjoy this feast 
Okay, I'm going to tell you what it tastes like and if it's really good in a bit. So I'm just going to start eating now. So guys, I'm starting to have my meal now. I'm going to fill the curry on top over here. Uh, if Okay, one more thing is if you want extra rice, it's 30 rupees. And if you want an extra piece of fish which comes with the thali, that is 100 rupees. So let's get into digging in. So I'm going to take a piece of fish. Okay, you can zoom in and let's see which one fish over here. So I'm going to cut a nice piece of fish over here. And okay, by actually bones we eat uh, fish curry rice by hand. But today I'm going to show you with the fork. So. This is really really good. Mm. This is delicious. So this is uh, has a nice uh, spice to it. The fish has a nice spice to it, which is called the famous Goan Reshad Masala. So it has a very thin layer, but it's spicy and it's very nice. It's a red masala. And the prawns, uh, as you can see here, there are a lot of prawns in this. So there are uh, smaller prawns here and as you can see there are bigger prawns as well in the curry and this has coconut in it so if you see this this is coconut okay so also to get on to the prawns let's get a big prawn like this uh, yeah. I'm going to take a big bite of the prawn go and see food guys that's the best thing they go out to do come and have a nice authentic Goan seafood so anyway we are going to continue with our meal uh, let Sharon try hers and then we will see what it's like then because I want to know if the mackerel has the same spice or not so let's show you guys so Sharon is starting to have her meal ok um, can I try a piece of your fish ok so she's going to cut it with her Oh, okay. So let's try this delicious looking fish. So it's mackerel. Okay, that's the mackerel. Mm. It's super. Okay, so the mackerel doesn't have as much spice as the kingfish. So it's uh, more rava fried. So it's very, very tasty. And if you're a non spice lover, who doesn't like spicy food then I would recommend this if you like spicy then I would recommend this or you could ask them for a reshad mackerel which is a red masala mackerel which is very spicy and tasty okay guys so if something you should know is when you are eating this don't use it with a spoon or something just take this and directly put it in your mouth so that's the best way to eat this tisrio which is shellfish and put some uh, lemon on the prawns which will give you that nice zing and tang and the vegetables I just tried out some of the vegetable it's this really sweet potato kind of taste so it's quite sweet I was surprised but it's quite sweet and uh, the pickle is uh, this one is a goan pickle guys so very delicious so guys we are done with our meal and it was really really good uh, something to know is always have seafood if you want come to a local place come to a local restaurant here in Goa especially in Panjim city or somewhere locals go to because they will give you the best quality and for a very cheap rate and you will get worth you know your money is worth so guys please keep on supporting me by subscribing and keep watching because I'll be doing a lot of other videos of really really nice places to check out guys. So thank you for watching. Please do like and subscribe.